Hello and welcome to another geeky and freaky video. In this one you will see how to use Fire TV Stick or any Android Smart TV as a Windows desktop extension wirelessly. It's done using an app called Space Desk, which acts as a virtual display adapter that connects wirelessly to the clients over regular Wi-Fi network. Space Desk can be used for setting up multiple monitors in parallel to conventional wired external monitors as well. This is slightly different from your regular screen mirroring and will work with devices even without wireless display protocol support. It doesn't require Wi-Fi direct support. You can even use it inside virtual reality headsets to enjoy your Windows virtual desktop in VR. But that's the topic for the next video. In this one, we'll start with the basic setup. First, let us see the usual method of screen mirroring or casting, which usually fails very frequently with Windows, though it works very fine with mobile or Android screen mirroring feature. Later, we will see how Space Desk can be used as pretty stable alternative to this. So go to the display settings on your Fire TV stick and select screen mirroring option. You can also do it by holding home button down for a couple of seconds. Once the Fire TV stick is in mirroring mode, go to the action center in Windows and select connect option. Windows should discover the Fire TV stick as a wireless display. Simply select that and mirroring should start in a moment. You see it is working well, right? But wait. In my case, as soon as I start working on the PC, the Fire TV stick disconnects with this message on screen. After that, I try several times, but it fails to connect. Many times, network connection on the Fire TV stick freezes, and sometimes even it restarts randomly. That's the reason why I looked for alternative solutions for screen casting in the first place. And my search ended with this wonderful app called Space Desk. Space Desk adds a virtual display adapter on your computer and the clients which can be running on Android TV or Fire TV Stick etc can connect to it over the network. So let us download Space Desk Display Driver for Windows 10 from here. Installation process is pretty straightforward, just click next next. Once installed, you will see the Space Desk icon in the system tray. Bring up the main interface by clicking on this icon and turn on the virtual display adapter. You will be notified with the IP address currently in use to which the client devices should connect. Make a note of this IP. Let's now move over to the Fire TV Stick and install the client app. This app is available from the Google Play Store and you can transfer it from your phone to the Fire TV Stick. If you don't know how to do that, let me know in the comment section and I can make a video demo of that as well. I am installing it from my network storage device to the Fire Stick at this moment. Start the Space Desk app and it will automatically discover the PCs that are connected on the same local area network. Simply select the PC to connect as a wireless display and it works like a charm. If your wireless network is slow, go to the settings and tweak image quality and resolution to achieve better performance. You can change the frame rate from 60 to 30 frames per second. I am using a 5 GHz Wi-Fi connection and had no issues even with best image quality with 1920 by 1080p Full HD resolution at 60 frames per second. Now you can go to projection settings on the PC and set it as duplicate or extended display. The client doesn't necessarily need to run on an Android TV or a Fire TV stick. You can connect from a browser also. That means any other computer on the same LAN could act as a wireless display. So imagine mirroring your computer screen onto any other device simply with a browser. No plugin or browser extension is needed for this purpose. Simply point the browser to this URL and feed in the IP address as displayed in the Space Desk application. You can even use mouse and keyboard for input from the remote computer.
Look at this demo where the presentation is being controlled from one computer but displayed on the other which is acting as a wireless display using the browser. In a follow-up video I'll show you how I used Space Desk to connect up to four monitors to my laptop simultaneously. Even more amazing and wow experience was to use my Windows desktop inside my Gear VR headset. You can use Windows Touch keyboard and mouse all with Bluetooth controller of the Gear VR. Use it to play games in virtual desktop or cast movies from your local hard disk to the big screen in your virtual theater. It's all so exciting. So stay tuned for the next video and consider subscribing to the channel for immediate updates and notifications. I'll see you in the next one.